Watch, I'll get four and then I'll get the loop. Two and then. Can't go off course again. Yeah, yeah. Now you see that one. Boom, 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 boom. All of them. And it's just two of these two. This plan is so legit. Thought I had my special missiles out, whatever. Spawn over here. Just to give me like more. Oh, I got an S. Oh, shit, fuck off. If you had the Falcon, maybe you could get every plane. shot at me. Thank you. 
hate how high these go. Oh, yeah, see, that's the title there. See, you can hit him. Most I've got is four hits and fucking shit shooting. Me. It's pissing me off. I'm high in the air. I'm gonna keep watching this play. This is gonna have to be a decimal video. It's over the time that allows me to go. Cutscene. It won't be long now. It won't be long till it begins. The barkeep's daughter confided to me. As a member of the resistance, she eagerly awaited the Allied counterattack on the mainland. What will happen to these people when the Allies come? I asked, to which she frowned. We'll run them out. This is our town. But I knew she didn't mean that from the bottom of her heart. Thirteen had captured her heart. I knew this from the way she shot jealous glances at his wingmen. As other pilots rotated out of Yellow Squadron, Yellow Four, Thirteen's wingman, always stuck by his side, even on land. The only female pilot in the squadron, she had Yellow Thirteen's absolute trust as his wingman. Yellow Thirteen seemed oblivious to all this, and instead reviewed the promising enemy pilot's performance from yesterday's skirmish. He's so close. If he manages to stay alive for just a while longer, that pilot could be a worthy opponent. But when there were no such enemies to look forward to, Thirteen's eyes were sad. That's it for this video. Give it a like, comment, favorite, and five, four, three.